Good evening, everyone. This is Bernstein Hurst again. We've uh, finally got our first cattle trailers coming out and are going to show you guys what we've got. This trailer is a trailer that uh, we designed whenever most old farm machinery dealers and I were much, much younger than what we are now. And we built these trailers for several, several years and then they got so expensive and so hard to build why we just quit. But we've decided that we'll come back and try it one more time and see if it's a, a possible possibility that we can build these trailers to where farmers can buy them. Uh, we've went into it. We do it ourselves every day. We farm every day. We've got trailers that we use. Um, I just fixed me a brand new one of these right here. And... Uh, plan on pulling it and uh, we started out with the same dimension as what we had to start with it's a 6 6 by 12 the other ones was 6 by 12 and these are 6 6 by 12 they're built out of uh, 14 gauge sheets two foot on each side it has the tender op fenders two 3500 pound axles drops with 15 inch radial tires we're using uh, one by three tubing for the vertical for the cross seals or the uh, long pieces on the sides of the trailer. The trailer's got a broke top on it to where that you uh, cattle don't get their foot if they get it in there they don't get hurt. Uh, we have uh, running boards on the front, or if you need to step up, you can. It's got a a little LED light in the front as well as one in the back at the outside to show. Um, we, uh, we run, uh, the trailer with LEDs in the back. We've got three LEDs in the center that is under the pipe. We, we put this pipe on here, uh, to help secure the safety of the, the animals. Uh, I'd never done that before, and, and my, one of my boys thought it was a real good idea, so we went ahead and, and tried that to where to see how it would work. Um, the gates are hung on three pins. They're built out of two by two tubing and one by three tubing. Uh, it has three pins on it. They're all turned vertical. And if you need to, you can take these gates off. They'll come out the top and you can have them completely come off. This rod, a pipe that uh, Lee Ed wanted put on the trailer is is uh, sticking out the distance to where that your handles will go in behind and they'll lock your gate. We've got a lock right here on this gate to where that the, uh, the lock, the actually safety lock won't open because this holds it down when you shut that down and that's behind both your gates. Uh, those, uh, the LED lights and all of our you can see them, and uh, we'll we'll get these. Okay, uh, this is open now. You see the use of the pipe in the bottom. It's put there. Just fold your hitch in and your latch, and it works. The gates open back. We did that to where you can help make shoots to load um, the floor. Is floored out of two by eights, number one grade, treated pine. Uh, we put a three quarter inch crack between each board to help keep it clean to where that the, the farmers that are our particular, and that's not me, you can ask my wife, but um, they like to keep their trailer clean. So this will let the manure fall out, and when they wash it, it'll be easier, and the floor will last a whole lot longer than it would the other way. Um, your cut gate is five foot tall. It has two pins on it. One sits flat on the bottom. We raised the gate about three inches off the floor to where that. And I put this solid sheet of metal four foot because I thought if you loaded an animal in front, it would be better if it couldn't see what was behind it. And the cattle would probably be better. We got a, a safety latch right here that holds the gate open whenever you 
you need to open it. And then when you get ready to shut him in there, just shut it and it's shut. There's a handle on the outside here that you pull that will open your gate. And you don't even have to come back in here to open it. It'll open itself back up when you do that. Then, uh, as far as, as the trailer itself, uh, it's uh, 78 inches clear inside. Uh, when you open your panels up on both sides, then your gate will take care of a whole hallway of a barn to where that you can back up to a barn and load your animals and then shut it. Uh, 3,500 pound axles, radial tires, all new, everything in it. It has 7,000 pound capacity. There's uh, enough room in it to haul several head of cattle. The front end of it is out of four inch channel. I'm sorry, five. And uh, we, uh, we've got a two inch hitch on it. Breakaway has the breakaway in the front. Uh, it has uh, the rails on the side up here at the top. This is put on for your tarp. And we're offering this tarp for this trailer, which we'll show in another video, for $300 if you put the tarp on yourself. But we will put this rod on, and it will be provided in the trailer it comes. If you want a trailer without a cut gate, it's $700 less. If you buy the trailer today on order, just order it for the get in the next four to six weeks. It's $56.60 without a cut gate. $700 for a cut gate, $300 for a tarp, $200 for an extra brake axle. So uh, we've tried our best to build something economical but good. And if you know of anything, you can look at it and you can tell me that it would improve the quality of this trailer and not improve the price, you let me know and I'd be tickled to death. My cell phone is 865-585-5729. Thank you so much. God bless you and hope you have a good weekend. Talking about the uh, rail to hold the tarp on, I failed to say that we've got three pieces of flat bar. There's a couple of good reasons for that flat bar on top that lies down. Uh, you have some animals like we've had, sometimes they want to come out. And uh, so, you know, we leave them and Next thing you know, we're out in the community hunting them. So the flat bar on top, there's three of them, and there's no way an animal can get out of it. And it's welded all the way around on both ends. The end of it is not sticking out. It's welded with another thought in it just to get it for you while you're still at, they're still at home. Thank you again. Hope you have a good day. Call me if I can help you anyway. Uh, call us, give us an order. We'll put you in a, a, a book, in our book, to get you a cattle trailer, and we'll get it back to you as soon as we can. Thank you, and God bless you.